Careful. Hey, hey, hey. Hey everybody, RV enthusiasts here. Hey, nice seeing you again. Hey, we have got the Jeep ready to go. We got the RV ready to go. And we are taking off to Bend, Oregon for the weekend. Looking forward to it. We took the top off the Jeep uh, a couple days back and the weather is supposed to be beautiful. So, uh, therefore, we will have in 90 degree weather, a Jeep with no top. My dogs have to find everywhere in the world to tinkle on. All right, let me get in here and set up. And we'll be off and running. Chilling. guys we had lunch at the Cottonwood Cafe in Sisters uh, it was good a little expensive but it was good hey everybody RV enthusiasts here nice seeing you again hey I got a couple things uh, we went to Bend this weekend uh, we went to Bend on Friday morning, uh, left here at 8, got to Bend about, oh, I think 2 o'clock, ah, 1.30. We stopped in Sisters, Oregon to have a bite to eat for lunch, uh, and it was good. It wasn't great. Uh, it was overpriced, um, and I'll put a little bit of episode from the drive there with that in it here uh, in this video as well. Um, and then from there, uh, we drove out to Bend. Um, we went to Thousand Trails. I did not have a reservation because um, every time I went online, they again uh, online said call the call the call them directly because online there's nothing available. Well, every time I called, all I got was recording. So I'm like, well, I'll take my chance and try Thousand Trails. And there's about four other camp uh, sites there as well. Well, Thousand Trails had nothing for Friday or Saturday. Um, and then we found a place that had a, uh, a stay for Saturday, Lapine, or Lapine, Oregon. The state park had a space for Saturday, nothing for Friday. Now, there are boondocking spots there. The Walmart there said, you know, you can't, or all of Oregon says you can't sleep overnight in an RV, but 
there were a ton of RVs there and a ton of trucks there, so I'm sure we could have stayed the night there. Um, but uh, one thing about boondocking, if I'm boondocking and I'm there, great. But if I'm boondocking and I'm going to, you know, tow my Jeep and I undo my Jeep and I take that somewhere and I leave my dogs in the RV, that's not happening. Uh, that's just not happening. So I wasn't comfortable with that um, for Friday. And Friday we, we did have a place in Redmond we could have gone to, which is about 18 miles north. Um, with all that being said, I just kind of got uh, a little tired of it, and it was an epic fail. So, uh, we just turned around after five hours there and took a five-hour ride back home. Needless to say, my wife was not happy, um, and I get it, I get it. Uh, the least, her least favorite part is riding in the RV, you know, for the long distances. So, I get that, um. And I don't do a lot of stopping on the way. And that's that's uh, that's a major fault of mine. I'm going to have to learn to do better. Trust me, it would make my life a lot easier if I did better with that. So um, anyway, Bend Weekend, epic fail. Don't go, uh, unless you plan on boondocking, don't go uh, without a reservation. Because uh, on weekends, it's full. We will be uh, 1,000 Trails members in September. So... With that being said, uh, maybe it would have made a difference. I don't know if you would have had to have reservations or if they hold a certain number back for their uh, their clientele. I don't know. Uh, but I will, I will find out eventually, and I will let you know on an update on that. The other thing I want to update you on is, uh, you know, you saw my shade video. And uh, if you watch a little bit of another video, I don't remember which one it is, you might have seen my valances going in to cover that. They weren't complete. Uh, we just came back. We took them to, to bend the way they were. We came back, and uh, today is what we did. We worked on the valances. So the valances are now complete. My wife is going to put one more coat of paint on them where we did it, where we, 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 she, she did some caulking. Um, and uh, let me give you a look at that and show you what it looks like uh, from here. So. Now, if you notice right there, there's a gap there, but that is not in our our performance. That is in the performance of the manufacturer. That is uh, a little arced there from the manufacturer. You come around the front, the front looks great. You come around this side, this side looks great. So, uh, that being said, I, I can live with that. Far better than the curtains. And yes, they come down. All right, there we go. So, it holds, comes down, holds. All the way down, holds, and then back up. And then the fronts work. Let me show you how they work. Just push this button here. This comes down. As it comes down in front of you, like so. And then, actually, if you look, it really is not a whole lot to get it all the way back up. One, two small tugs, a tug and a half, and it's a back up. Anyway, that's the valances. Like I said, she's going to put another coat of paint on them. Notice at the ends, we do have the returns. They do return back to the wall. Uh, it returns back to the wall here. And again, uh, it looks great. We like it. We're very happy with it. Um, and it took a couple of days to do. First day, you know, we kind of fitted it and tested it and looked at it. It was like, yeah, we're not real fan of how it looked. And so we retroed that a little bit more. And now we're happy with what we have. If you're going to Bend, Oregon, and you don't want to boondock, you better have a on, and you're on a Friday or a Saturday, you had better have a reservation because it's a, it's a big enough town with not a whole lot of RV uh, spots. And as, as everyone knows, they're, they're selling RVs like crazy, but they're not expanding the RV sites. So uh, first come, first serve. Uh, it's first reservation is first served here. Uh, anyway... Uh, you know, it's not that big of a deal. Uh, I don't mind driving the RV. I, the only thing I wasted was a tank of gas. So what? Um, and the worst part is the wife when she's not happy. That's that's worse than anything. So I get it. Uh, I'm, I'm slow at picking stuff up, but I get it. All right, guys. That's all I have for this episode. Uh, again, epic fail in Bend. Uh, 
you know, I wait so long for them, and then, of course, in my head, I'm, I'm shot about it, so I'm like, I'm going home. I'm good to go home. So, uh, yeah, don't let that happen to you. All right, guys, remember, full-time, part-time, anytime is a great time to RV. Thank you.